Dan Budic here, Lifetime Athletic with Craig Rallo. Craig, big time win over No Mercy in the playoffs. You guys were blowing them out at half. What did they do differently in the second half? Well, Ming caught a little fire. We, we got a little lazy. You know, we have another game coming up right now, three of us. So we got a little lazy. Let Ming shoot a little bit. You can't let him shoot. We guard When you guard Ming, he can't score. But in the second half, we just let him shoot. And if you let him shoot, he's going to hit all day long. Yeah, he was red hot. And I think he had 20, 25 points in the second half. What is it going to take to get to the next level and win that championship game? You know, we lost the championship last year because Mike wasn't here, Mastro. Now we got Mike back. With Mike, Dave, and Mike, and, you know, it's we're, we're unstoppable. Nobody's beating us. There's nobody in this gym that could beat us. We have the two best players on the gym in the same team with Mike and Dave, and they're unstoppable. And it showed again tonight. You know, I lead the league in assists because I get to give them the ball. Yeah, you're, you're an assist machine. You know, we always give you credit for it. Craig, thanks for the time. Good luck in the championship. Thanks so much. Welcome back. Oh, thank you. Dan Budick here with Jordan Orger, the Renegades. Big win tonight. What would you guys do positively? Uh, I mean, when we move the ball around, when we play good defense, you know, we, our offense feeds off our defense. We're a tough team to beat, especially when we swing the ball. It's, a, it's going to be tough to beat us. You know, following the league from afar, your defense have been iffy at times this year. What, what, what did you guys do to put it together tonight? Well, a couple of times we get lazy. We just got to remind ourselves that defense wins, our, wins us games. You know, the offense is going to come and go, but the defense, if it's always there, will be in good shape. All right, and, uh, you know, obviously good luck the rest of the way, but is there any truth your dad's coming back and playing? Uh, I don't know about that. Uh, did he say that? I don't know, but his cameo on Entourage, it was on TV the other day. Yeah, night. yeah, maybe he's going to make a guest appearance. I don't know. All right, Jordan, thanks for the time. Good luck the rest of the Thank way. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Dan Budick here, joined by Mike Clifford and Dave Massey. Guys, second game tonight. We'll start with you, Mike. What goes into playing so many games, so many uh, minutes a night? As long as you don't stiffen up, you're good. Heart, play, rebound, give him the ball, get out of the way. You know, lot, definitely a different feel in this game. You guys dominated the whole game as opposed to a first game where you, know, you kind of let them get back into it. What's the different styles, especially when you're up by so many points? You got to keep your foot on the gas. We didn't in the first game. This game we did. The first game we started dragging, bringing the ball up. We, let, we went back into their game. But we survived, and then this game we just stayed on them. Defense. Defense wins every game. Move over to Dave. Dave, you think it's possible two championships in both leagues? One championship in each league? That's what we've been talking about. So that's the plan. We're almost we're halfway there. A couple games left. And uh, hopefully by Wednesday night we'll be celebrating two championships. Good you know, you both dominate both offensively and defensively. Is there a different style of game when you go into a, a veterans game as opposed to an open league game? Completely different. Completely different. So the open league game is a lot more up and down, fast pace. And the, uh, the vets game is a lot more physical. But, you know, we got three guys that played in both. But it takes, you know, the, the whole team, six or seven guys to win. Held them to 31 points tonight, which is a tremendous defensive effort. That's a good shooting team. Yeah, absolutely. Can shoot, Jay can shoot, Ken can shoot. So to hold them to 31, I think, talks about uh, just how determined we were and how hard we play on defense. All right, Dave, good luck the rest of the way. Good Mike, good luck the rest of the way. Don't worry, Jake. He's coming up there to get. Yeah. <laughs>